What's up, YouTube? <clears throat> um, why am I making this video today? Just to talk about some hair issues. Okay, that's what I want to talk about, hair issues. Um, Lately, I have this really bad phobia. When I say lately, I mean like, <coughs> excuse me, like, um, it was always in the back of my mind, but really, like, the last couple months, like, it's really, really bothering me. And it is something that I see happening to a lot of ladies with locks. It is something that somehow nobody else is noticing because in the videos, I'm seeing them um, not really ask questions about it. And so I don't know if it's like a, a, a medical thing, a health issue, or what, or is it something that they're doing to their hair that's making this happen. But it is bald and sad. And I'm not, I don't want to offend anybody who may have a hereditary issue with thinning sides or whatever. But what I'm noticing is, I'm noticing that a lot of ladies with dreads is retwisting their hair or latching their hair and then pulling them back or pulling them up or fishtailing them or doing something to pull them into these tight styles. And I'm noticing that, like, I could see a video. They'll have a couple styles, like back-to-back, -back, braid out, pull up, up dudes, whatever. And then it's just, bam, then it, it'll be, uh, it won't be a video for like, you know, maybe a month or two. And then, bam, here comes this person on a video doing an update. Here comes this person on a video doing an update. And bam, their sides are thin or either bald. And it's something that <clears throat> I'm scared. I ain't gonna lie. I don't want my size to be bald. If my size is bald or thin it or going bald, I don't want everybody to just act like it's just, oh, 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 it's here pretty, you know, when you ain't seen me in a month or two. No, I want you to ask, what's happening? You know, like, what happened? You been pulling your hair too tight? Like, why your size going thin? Or, you know, something. Don't just act like it's not there. And I'm noticing this a lot on the YouTube videos, and I'm scared to touch my hair, y'all. I'm not even going to lie. I'm scared to pull it back. I'm scared to pull it up. I'm scared to put a headband on it. Like, I'm tearing sad because I'm like, what is, you know, what is the problem with the size? I'm like, is it something that just happened, you know, to maybe everybody or what? But then I'm like, no, it can't be that because I don't see it with the dudes. And if the dude said he is, you know, thin, they usually have a little lineup or something. Or I see dudes with shape up, but most of the time I don't see the videos of the dudes. You know, they size are intact. And I'm wondering, like, what is going on with the ladies and their edges? You know, is it something that you guys are using? And like I said, I'm not. I don't want to. I'm not trying to be offensive. I'm not trying to dog nobody. I really want to know because this is really, really a phobia, man. Back when I had um, loose hair, I used to get perms. Um, I got some Tazillions, and I wore them for like a couple months, you know. And when I took them out, I lost hair on my edges. And I wanted to cry, you know what I'm saying? I just wanted to break down and cry because I... I would rather my hair fall out in the back first than in the front. You know what I'm saying? So... I, like I said, it's it's something I'm scared. Like, what's going on with the edges? Okay, so if anybody can answer that for me, you know, <clears throat> is, it, is it the way you style me your hair? Is it because you, because me, when I um latch or when I do a fresh latching or whatever, I don't pull my hair up. Like, I wait for a, maybe a week or two before I even do anything to it. So, I don't know. Y'all, yeah, somebody tell me. Um, what else? Right now, me and my hair are at war, and I'm not winning. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. I don't like it. I don't like it. It's getting on my nerves. Not that I don't like it. Let me take that back. I like it. I, it's get, if I could section this off right here, if I could take this whole section... 
and take them out and redo them, I would today if I could. I promise you I would. I don't know what's going on with this top. Sometimes they feel super skinny. Sometimes they feel like they okay. Sometimes they not doing nothing. Sometimes they are. Oh my God, it's just horrible. I don't know. I don't know. Um, I got a ton of fuzz up here, which don't, that don't bother, the fuzz don't bother me. But I'm going to some of everything to these things, y'all. I done, they got knots in them, I done tied them, I done sold them, I done seesawed them, I done did. <sighs> this top part I'm having a really, really hard time with, I'm not even going to lie. I'm having a real hard time, and I, I clipped a couple ends because they never did um, lock up, and they were still kind of, like, not, I don't know what was wrong with them, but I clipped some ends. Some I didn't clip. Um, some I did. <coughs> um, one point in time I had, like, a bunch of two-headed dragons. I took all the... Cut the weakest, cut the weakest tail off, and attached it to other ones. Like this one right here is um is an attachment from a different lock. Uh, it's a couple in the back. The the back seem like it is not growing, and it's like right at that length. To as soon as it hit my shoulder, it curl up. So I'm walking around with my hair. Bunched up in the back all day. I just, I just wish it would hang. I don't know. What to, you see how you see that? I don't know what to do about that. Um, get a look real quick. These roots. And if I look oily, it's because. I put some oil on my hair a little while ago. Back. Back. Episode. Top. Yeah, look, just look, just look here, just straight. <sighs> I don't know. I don't know what to do about it. I really don't. I'm not at the point to where it's, um, I feel like I want to start over or take them down or whatever. I'm not to that point. I'm just to the point of it's almost two years. Um, for almost two years, it, this is a lot of growth because I cut all my hair off, so I had a TWA. So this is a lot of growth for almost two years, and I know it's even actually longer than this if it was to be, you know, stretched out, because I know it's boiled up. So I'm not complaining about the growth or nothing. I'm just complaining about the manageability. I can't do nothing like it's. It needs to hurry up and get longer. That's all I'm going to say. It just needs to hurry up and get longer. So that's it, y'all. I ain't gonna, what I'm at, uh, nine minutes. Um, <clears throat> I'm gonna hold you. I ain't gonna make this video too long. So, yeah, that's it. That's all that's going on with it. And then I feel like I'm missing not being able to spritz it with water on a daily because it's winter time now. So, I'm not gonna be spritzing my hair and then going outside. So, I don't know. And then these two are connected. And these two are connected. And that's my gray. Say hi to it. <laughs> Need to color my roots. Yeah, so that's it. That's it, y'all. Peace. Um, I'm I'm so serious, y'all, on that issue about the um sideburn. I mean, not sideburns, about that issue about the edges. Y'all, please let me know. And if it's a, if it's like something like um, you got some of your hair up too tight, please, please be careful about pulling your hair up, you know what I'm saying, because sometimes you, 
thin that hair and pull it and snatch it like that and um it, it won't grow back, you know, or either it'll take a long time growing back. So y'all be careful with that. But yeah, somebody let me know. Yeah. Everybody have a good one. Bye.